nice and easy. Let that head just be heavy and loose. Good. Perfect. Good. Nice and easy. Perfect. So what do you think of your first uh, adjustment? Honestly, like the neck part probably felt the best and then the relief off my back. Yeah. Good. Okay, so real quick, let's have you stand up again. We'll take a look at those ranges of motion. So let's go ahead and have you reach down, touch your toes as far as you can. Okay, and then come on back up. And let's have you face this way and then show us how you go back there. So pretty restricted there. Okay. All right, so we're going to go in here and get you adjusted. So we'll have you lay on your back and we'll start with your neck and we'll work our way down, okay? Uh, you'll be fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, are you nervous at all? No. No. Okay. So we'll Maybe walk. the neck one a little bit. Yeah. We'll, not, we'll walk you through it here. So, we're going to come in right up here, okay? So, I'm going to lift you up a little bit right here. And then just let me have all the way to that head. Good. It's going to be fast, but it won't hurt. Good. What do you think of that? That feels so good. Okay. So now we're going to come over here to this left side. Now you're a little bit stiff right here. You feel that? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're going to go here. Good. Nice and easy. Let that head just be heavy and loose. Good. Perfect. Good? Yes. <laughs> okay. Deep breath in. Out. Okay. Give you a little pull. Awesome. Okay, so now we're gonna come in and work on that low back. So let's have you roll on your side, face me over here. And I'm gonna lift this up. It's gonna be like a little shelf for your head. So scoot down just a bit, perfect. Okay, so your bottom leg will stay straight. Your top leg is gonna be bent, just like that. I'm gonna bring your hip a little closer, good. I'm gonna pull you off your shoulder and then we'll have this hand go right there and this hand go right there. Is that comfortable for you? Yes. Okay, so nice and relaxed. I'm gonna roll you a bit. Okay, so we're gonna come in on that tailbone. What we're gonna do is we're gonna kind of rock it back this way. So take a big deep breath in, exhale. Okay, let your belly be loose. I'm gonna roll you a little bit and good. Now, how'd that feel? That feels really good. Okay. Let's have you roll over to the other side. Bottom leg straight. Good. Top leg bent. Okay. So same type of thing. Let's bring that bottom hip forward a little bit towards me. A little more. Right there. Okay. And we'll go right here. I'm going to pull you off that shoulder just a bit. Good. And right there. Okay, so for this one, we're going to be a little higher up in that sensitive spot in your back. You doing okay? Yeah, my neck was just off the... Okay. Right in here. So, same type of thing. I'm going to have you just take a deep breath in. Exhale. Good. I'm going to roll it a little bit. Good. Nice and easy. Perfect. How's that? Felt okay? Yes. Good. Okay, so now let's have you go face down. Good. All right, we'll just drop those arms off top again. Good. Okay. A little bit too much? Okay, sorry. Tender through here. All right, so we're gonna come in right through here. I'll have you take a deep breath in, out. Let your shoulders relax, good. Perfect. Okay, one more deep breath in, out. Okay. A little stiff here still. So I'm going to put my hand right here. I'm going to give your head a little turn. Keep everything nice and loose. Good. 
good. Nice and easy. Okay. One more. Good. Okay. That's a little tough, huh? Mm -hmm. Let's try this instead. You doing okay? Yes. Sorry about that. I know those kind of are uncomfortable when they don't go. So we'll go right here. And then let's have you turn your face to the right and lay it flat on the table. Good, I'm gonna put you right there. That okay for you? Mm -hmm. All right. So I'm gonna tilt you back just a bit. Let the shoulder relax as much as you can. Good, we're gonna give you a little push. There we go, a little bit. Come back to the center. Okay, let's try one more here. So we'll have you stand up and come on over here. We're gonna try one more from standing, see if we can get any more movement in there. So we'll have you come stand right here. And let's see if I can put this somewhere where it's not gonna. Right. We'll have you face this way and come back here toward me. Face that way. Yeah, great. So take a couple steps back, right there. Okay. So how this one's gonna work is you're gonna interlace your fingers behind your neck. So you have the right to remain silent. I'm just kidding. So we'll go right here and right here. And then widen your feet out a little bit. Perfect. So how it's going to work is I'm going to kind of lean you back and I'm going to give you a little chest bump to okay. work on that. So what you're going to do is squeeze your elbows together in front of your face. Okay. Yeah, so squeeze your elbows. Good. Now bring your chin down to your chest. Good. Okay. So a deep breath in. Exhale. Good. I'm going to lean you back. Let your hips relax. Everything loose. Squeeze the elbows. Look down. Good. Okay, a little bit in there. You can definitely see why you feel so stiff. <laughs> okay, so let's have you come on over here. We'll do a couple of those movements again and just see how you're doing now. So let's have you reach down, touch your toes. Good, and then come on back up. Now, how's that feel? That's good. A little better? It's a little too. A little better. <laughs> and then um, go ahead and let's face this way and kind of bend backwards like you did before. Been in much further now. Oh, yes. How's that feel compared to before? Better, yeah. Good. Before it felt like a crushing like weight. Compressed, yes. yeah. And let's have you go chin to chest as far as you can. And then look back to the ceiling. And then I know before you said looking to the left kind of felt tight, so how's that? Oh yeah, it feels so much better. Good. All right. Like I know it's still a little tense, but it feels so much better looking at neck. Good. I'm glad. So what do you think of your first uh, adjustment? Honestly, like the neck part probably felt the best and then the relief off my back. Yeah. I think that's the biggest thing. Good. Well, I'm so happy to, to work with you. Um, we'll kind of keep working with you and kind of get some more movement in there as we go forward. But um, for today, that was really good. We got a lot of movement, and so that should take a lot of the muscle spasm down, and you should feel much better. Okay. So. Should I wait longer to lift? Um, no. You know, one of the things I always say to patients is that chiropractic should add to your life, not take away from it. So you did kind of hurt yourself lifting, but as you kind of go back into your workout routines, just kind of listen to your body as you go back. So, you know, I'm never gonna be the doc that tells you don't go work out. So, but let's say, you know, you get into a deadlift and you're doing some of your warm up sets or you're working up to your working set and you're just like, ah, I don't know, something feels off. Nothing wrong with just bailing on it for that workout and doing a different movement. And then eventually we definitely want to get you back into deadlifts because, you know, Worst case scenario, we don't want you to have deadlifts be off limits for your whole life, right? So, um, yeah, chiropractic should add to your life, not take away from it. So just kind of for now, listen to your body, do what feels good. If you start to get kind of um, not warm, fuzzy feelings about an exercise, just bail on it and you can come back to it once you're feeling better. So and we'll kind of just keep you moving in that direction.